Hi, Neil McPherson here at Worksworth Gunroom. Uh, now generally, if I'm in the workshop, I do all the workshoppy things in the workshop itself. Um, but today, I'm going to do part of the job out here because today we've got um, a muzzle loading rifle that's got a stuck ball, the uh, nipple's been removed, and most of the powder uh, shaken back out of it, so it should be shouldn't be any black powder left in it but um, you can never be sure it's been dosed with oil so I'm not really expecting it to go off the problem is um, we can't get the ball out so I've machined up um, a little adapter here I'm connecting it to a compressed air bottle that um, would be nice to think it got 300 bar in but I think it's quite down so maybe it won't quite do it but um, I'll put my safety specs on and uh, we'll see how it goes So a leak. <laughs> See what we can do to address that. I must take for everything. So that's leaking too. There we go. Well, I'll uh, freely admit that was a bigger pop than I was expecting. Um, you can perhaps see here it's uh, hit the sandbag good start. Um, so I'll have a rummage, see if we can find. Ah, I think that. Oh. Ah, hang on. Now that's just a bit of. I wonder if it even went right through to the other side. I think. I'll have to shake this out. I'm very glad I didn't do it in the workshop. What is? Ah. There is the offending article. Already been attacked with a worm before I got hold of it. 
which uh, exercise seems to have, it's probably actually going into the sand has expanded the front of that. But uh, I think if that had a black powder load behind it, it would have been right through the wall too. Anyway, there we go. If we uh, can't send it out with black powder, we can send it out with compressed air. I hope that's been a bit of fun for you. Bye.